We've got about 10 minutes left, just so everyone knows. Uh, next question down here. We have one back up there, too, I see. Hi, I know it's a lot of work to put on an event like this, and I was wondering how each of you balance work and play during the week. You mean on board? Yeah. Oh. Uh. <laughs> They're all kind of one thing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we wouldn't, you know, we wouldn't do it if it weren't also really fun and, and rewarding to us. And uh, I mean, it's stressful, and, and we're kind of working all the time, but it's not. Uh, I mean, you know, we're not digging ditches here. We're, we're my, you know, yesterday my work was that I had to go to four or five different cocktail parties, like that's, and one of them wearing a dress, and that's, all of that was incredibly uh, fun and exhausting. Uh, but uh, so, so I don't know, balancing, balancing work and play. We, we all have a little. Uh, uh, we we like to uh, have a little time. I'm very glad we're going to Happen Key. I expect to have. A short stretch with my family on the beach. Very brief. Look for that. Yeah, very yeah. brief. Hi guys. <laughs> I think that's the big thing. Is even though everything we do, we enjoy, um, and I think Drew should talk after we talk. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but, Drew may have a different opinion. But the big thing is that we often don't really have the choice of what we do at any given time, or just sort of time to be like, ah, oh, what am I going to do right now? So that might be the only difference, at least for me. Yeah, but we do try and our, at, try around at least some time during each day when we can to just enjoy ourselves or relax a little bit or just you know, watch some of the shows. I always try to keep my head in as many of the events as I can, uh, not just because I'm in charge of them making sure they run smooth, but because I want to see them. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, I wouldn't, for me personally, I wouldn't say it's so much incredibly stressful as it is just pretty much always busy, which is nice compared to previous years when it was incredibly stressful. Yeah, it, it really was. Um, I think, uh, sorry, for those who don't know, Drew is in charge of our operations. So, of the people on the stage, he's actually the one who is doing things. Um, all, the, all the stuff you don't see he's in charge of, and all the stuff that you don't see that makes the things you see happen, he tends to... All the things you don't even know about. <laughs> so many things we will never ever tell you. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I think the thing about planning, uh, spending all year planning for one week, um, is that during that one week, you sort of have special powers to not sleep at all and uh, feel fine. And so I, I feel like I don't want to miss a single hour of this because we've spent the entire rest of the year leading up to this uh, talking about and exactly where the coffee setup will be. Yeah. And the next one to go and see, there's the coffee setup that I asked for. It's not just sell D 963 anymore. <laughs> hey, look, those, those napkins we order are actually here and being used. <laughs> there's that eight foot table on the port side of the theater. <laughs> oh, oh, the table. Oh, the table. Oh, eight foot table. Remember oh. when they tried to give us a six foot table? Oh, oh that was oh, a oh, nice oh, yeah, words. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I. It's it's also it's fun it's fun to see this happen and it's very meaningful I think even though uh, every conversation I have with someone except for being up here where I put my phone in a stand I, is interrupted by a phone call on my ship's cell phone it is very there are a lot of beautiful meaningful moments and uh, every once in a while um, I, I have to just duck out of the meeting to, to cry in the corner about how beautiful this <laughs> is so it's um, yeah. I, I, I don't say this in an egotistical way. It is incredibly satisfying to see this a thing that you have worked very hard to make actually happen and to go well and to see people and hear people enjoying it. It is that's one of the reasons I think I'm able to stay up and not collapse during this week is because it is it's so fulfilling uh, to have this event go well and to have people come back again and again and again. So that that certainly stays me during this week. Yeah. 